Okay, hello everyone. Again, we are streaming live from Tumen. You see those dirty cars. Those road. This is our road. These are pipes. These are pipes bringing us the heating. We need the heating. So, so thankful for all of you. And we are here in Tumen, Russia. So please look. This is my papa. Hello everyone. So we want to just share a little devotional about uh, something I've been meditating this morning. And uh, yesterday we watched. We were taking communion in the in the body of Christ, and we were watching a, a short video from Gospel of John when Jesus was washing the feet of Jesus of his disciples before uh, breaking the bread with them and it was it was so so amazing because uh, somehow we in, in the process of our Christian growth somehow Jesus becomes more of a concept to us or, 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 or an idea or a doctrine we uh, highly esteem and, uh, and we think that uh, our relationship to God is basically based upon uh, upon some some ideas we we follow, but it's it is much more than than we realize that the Christianity was not based on a system. There was a very good system, so to speak, uh, before Jesus came in. There was a religious system. There was a Levitical system. Uh, by which uh, the Jewish, uh, the Israel nation was following, and when Jesus came in, it seemed like he, I mean, he he said he didn't come to break the law but to fulfill the law, but here and there he was doing something that was kind of shaking that system, and uh, and he was introducing uh, people to something absolutely new. He was introducing them to to his father. And that uh, they, that he was going to establish a relationship based on him, and he is the foundation of Christianity, not a system. And somehow we are like tending to to uh, put our life on a system, to put our life on some on something good. Maybe uh, it's our surrounding. Maybe it's uh, background we we grew up. Even in Christianity, we we love we. We kind of feel safe in a system, and uh, and it can be it can be good, but uh, but if if we if we realize that our life is not uh, changing, if our, our life is uh, becoming more confined to a system, and we are not experiencing the fruit of the spirit, we are missing the foundation. We are building something of our of our own, and Jesus Christ is the person he is the foundation and when, as we watch that little video of jesus washing the feet it's just uh it was just incredible because this is this is who god is it's not uh some good idea it's not uh, just theology this is uh, god he is a living person he is expressed in life and uh, and that's what we actually were made for we were made for a living relationship and and our Christianity is uh, living our Christianity is experienced and it, it is uh, brings a real fulfillment when it is experienced in in living relationship and God wants to be expressed in living relationship that's why you know when we stumble over people maybe we stumble over a church or about some system which is maybe good or maybe not so good but we realize that uh, in the end really the where Jesus Christ is in the center where he is esteemed and where he is lifted up as a as a person as the God himself and we believe that everything is held by him and everything was made by him not by systems that we we created and even like maybe I'm saying I will say something which maybe not will uh, not uh, you will not maybe totally agree but I, I just want to say that Christianity is not even based on the scriptures 
even though the scripture is the word of God it is uh, it is his it is his revelation of him but we uh, the, the, the written word was given to us to reveal the living word it was introduced to us not to become an end in itself but to bring us to the end which is Jesus Christ and if we are opening the scriptures and we are just seeing the do's and don'ts and we are like just uh, putting ourselves we can become even legalistic we can even relate to people uh, even it's amazing you know we may know something and then in a situation we're just relating to people on the, on the basis of the Bible we're using the Bible as a means to even to, uh, to feel ourselves better to be like self-righteous it's it's amazing you know what what can happen if we are not living in a living relationship with Christ and 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 uh, so the foundation of Christianity is Jesus Christ he is the foundation and his word is the revelation of that foundation and and our faith must be related directly to him directly to him that's what every born again believer has today you have it as a child of God I have nothing you don't have and you don't have any, don't have anything that I don't have in Jesus Christ. This is our fullness. This was Apostle Paul was praying that the body of Christ would have a, that such amazing, great revelation of Jesus Christ and the hope that we have in Him. Well, may God bless you. Thank you so much for watching, and welcome to our our frozen land. Oh, look at this! Something is burning. Oh my God. God bless you. We love you. And please know God loves you very much. Bye-bye.